waiting for my bus at 5 30 in the morning and guess what i found a deer in the middle of the road in the suburbs a christmas decorated surface trolley that i see i'm not gonna miss it because philippines celebrates christmas in a total different way arrived at 30th Street Amst Amtrak Station in Philadelphia. Isn't it beautiful? I'm here about one and a half hours early. I like to be early so I can just take my time and relax and just chill. Finally arrived at Moynihan train station in New York City. Isn't this train station grand? So now all I'm doing is waiting for my sister Chad to come pick me up. This is the outside of the Moynihan train station. So we're now out here in downtown streets of New York City. Here I am in Koreatown. We had delicious breakfast at this place. And off we went to the Empire State Building where my sister has a fast pass that we used to bypass all the crowd of people. It's a faster way of getting up to the observation deck. Anyway, story time. I went to uh, New York City to replace my current Pennsylvania driver's license before I officially move to Miyagao Iloilo. Um, even though I still have about four more years still left on my driver's license, I decided to have it uh, replaced because I already, uh, I already sold my home in uh, Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. So I don't want any problems when they see that I still have my old address on my um, Pennsylvania license. So this is what I did. Um, it make it easier because I've been watching other YouTube videos of expats that retired and they were mentioning about things that they should have done before they left the United States or their, um, you know, or the countries that they were from. So I don't want to make the same mistakes that they did. So before, um, just right after breakfast, which we had, we went, uh, we had a little time to kill. So we went to, you know, the Empire State Building. And after the Empire State Building, I will be on my way to the Department of Motor Vehicles of New York to renew my license. Uh, I won't have any videos of that because um, we're not allowed to, you know, uh, videotape the DMV. I don't want to get kicked out and I haven't even, you know, um, left the country yet. So, so I'm just trying to get this all in. So these are, um, uh, some of the, you know, some of the things that, uh, or, um, some of the things that I'm doing now before I leave, because I don't know when the next time I'll be back you know, back to the United States. My family is still here in the United States. So I'm going back to the Philippines to take care of my mother. Um, she went, the, I, I dropped her off ahead, you know, off my arrival, just so we had everything ready. So uh, she's enjoying the weather there right now. Beautiful weather. Right now it's a little chilly. It's about, uh, I believe up in this building is maybe uh, 50 degrees. Uh, that's uh, 50 degrees Fahrenheit, I think. A little chilly, but uh, believe it or not, I had my coat open. It was beautiful. I love fall 
or autumn weather. But I'm looking forward to the warm weather of the Philippines. Wow, well, here's a lot of uh, tourists here. And it's a Friday morning, mind you. Look at that. No, I'm not that tall. I just have my arm all the way up above my head with my phone on hand. You would notice a couple of times that um, you would see the video past this metal grate, metal, um, you know, boundary. But believe it or not, I, I wasn't really supposed to do that. I just wanted to get an unobstructed view. But I was holding on to my phone for dear life. Like here, right here. I don't want my phone to drop. Oh, no sorry. A lot of tourists here. I did notice uh, some few Filipinos up here. You can tell because they were speaking Tagalog. But I didn't say anything. I was just listening. I'm being chismosa. So. Yep, this is a uh, all-around wrap around the building. My sister is staying warm inside. Yeah, there's not much people in this section here because the better views are on the other side. I'm not sure. Is that the uh, Hudson River? I don't know. Sis, help here. I'm not sure. Yep. Mom, I was here. And we got a souvenir shot. Dinner was eating pita at Misden at Hudson Yard. After our early dinner, we went just walking around and we chanced upon Dylan's candy bar here at Hudson Yard. Look at that delicious candy store. And ending to a perfect time in New York City was, of course, pistachio ice cream. So delicious. Thank you, sis for taking me in and helping me out in New York City.